All right. Uh, this is uh, January 3rd, 2019. I'm doing this drawing here of Black Widow, um, but I'm doing it differently. Normally, I would uh, do the drawing in more of a uh, you know, traditional comic book style, but I decided instead to go with uh, Archie style, like just for the heck of it. Because the two previous sketches that I did for the Stanuary Challenge, um, Spider Man and who was the other one? I don't remember. Oh, Kingpin. Um, I did those more of a traditional style. But as you see, I already I already did the pencil drawing. I, I'm going to ink it. And I actually did two different uh, copies of this, or versions of this, um, of Black Widow, just because you don't see the original very often. This is the more uh, recognized costume. But when I turn the page, this was, the, ignore the hands, I don't know, oh, and I got something on the hand, darn it. Um, this was Black Widow's original costume when she was first appeared in Marvel Comics. So I'm probably, I'm going to try to ink both of them if it doesn't take too long. Right now I'm trying to invite some people to uh, come to watch, and I'm not even sure if my volume is working, to be honest. So uh, I'm doing this drawing as part of the, like I mentioned, the uh, uh, they're calling it Stanuary. Stanuary Lee. It's supposed to be uh, in honor of Stan Lee, uh, who died in November 2018, and um, his birthday was um, the 28th of December. And it's kind of a challenge for artists um, to, I don't know if you want to call it a challenge. Yeah, I don't know. But it's um, every day. Um, Every day, you're, you're kind of assigned to a character. The first day was Spider-Man. The second day was Kingpin. Today's uh, challenge was uh, is Black Widow. I don't know tomorrow's because I haven't looked yet. But I've all, I posted images of the other two. And like I said, I'm trying, I'm just, I'm, right now I'm inviting people to view the video. That's why it's taking so long for me to get started. Uh, I'm trying to invite, uh, former students as well, in case they are interested, but I'm drawing a blank. Well, that should work for now. All right, so like I said, I'm, uh, this what is uh, part of, uh, let me write it down here. Day three. Stanuary. All right, normally I would uh, ink with a lighter, a thinner pen, but being that this is a cartoon, more of a cartoon style, the Archie style. I'm going for a thicker 
therapy. I've always liked the uh, RP Comics because it's uh, it's in quite nicely. Now, if uh, if you can hear me, can you uh, comment something? Because I'm not sure if my sound is on. And in the early days of uh, Archie Comics, they tended to give the women black lipstick, basically. Can anybody hear me? And I might just go with the uh, simple inking so I can move on to the next picture. <clears throat> if you can hear me, please feel free to sh uh, share this with others. Nice thing about doing the inking is if I made any mistakes in the pencil drawing, I can fix it now. And another thing that I like about uh, Archie Comics is how Closely with my uh, like anatomy more realistically than you would expect in comics, like you know, funny books. And if you have any questions, feel please feel free to ask. I'm keeping an eye on the screen while I'm drawing. Uh, I saw a couple of hearts. Thank you for that, if you can hear me. I never noticed on Black Widow's uh, belt that she actually had the little symbol of the Black Widow. You can hear me, Alicia? Fantastic.
nobody else chimed in, let me know. Now hopefully I'll be I'll eventually color this so people can actually tell the Thank you everybody who is joining me. I appreciate it. Now I'm assuming that Black Widow wore the uh, the hot dogs on her wrists in case she got hungry while fighting crime. For those of you just joining, this is me doing a drawing of um, Black Widow from Marvel Comics and the style of Archie Comics. As part of the, uh, the Stanuary um, Artist Challenge. I don't know who made it up. Uh, I just saw a post of it where, um, in honor of Stan Lee, there was a, I'm just going to call it a challenge. There was a challenge of uh, directed towards artists to draw or do a sketch of a Marvel character every day of January. And it's the, uh, the characters are kind of assigned. And this was the third day of January. This, so this is the third fig, third character that was assigned. The, the first one was Spider-Man, and the second one was um, Kingpin. And they also noted, I appreciate the fact that they noted that uh, not every character that was uh, listed was a creation of Stan Lee's. Okay, so there's the first... Uh, the first image, and normally I would erase, but it would take too long. Plus, my eraser's not in the best shape. I also did the uh, the original costume for. Uh, for not black canary wow wrong universe altogether um black widow the original black widow costume which is what i'll be inking next and that one's a little bit tougher i screwed up on the hands and something got spilled on the picture somehow
Looks like she's trying to... I don't know why. I, I drew this late. I drew this when I was really tired, so... Uh, I don't know what I was doing with the hands. It looks like she's th uh, playing ball or something. Or playing catch with somebody. In the style of our clients. Got a couple of different hairdos in the early days. But I thought this was a little bit more fun, farther from the uh, the typical black widow look. She also had different color hair. And I love the fact that her earrings are bees for black widow. And normally I uh, don't go for too thick a line for uh, when I'm illustrating. Oh, oh, geez, I have a tiny camera. But being that I'm doing this on a live video, I wanted to make sure that my lines actually showed up on screen. There. Oops, I wanted to use that. I really love the um, artwork from Archie Comics, specifically in the 50s and 60s. And for the life of me, I can't think of the name of the artist or artist. I'm a band of Carlos was one. Was it Stan Goldberg? I can't remember if that's right or not. But I also, one of the things I one of the reasons I'm big into Archie comics is when I was a kid, they had a uh, little Archie digest. And I used to have a subscription to that. Thank you, Mom and Dad. That was back when you can actually get subscriptions of books that you wanted. Of course, I had Grew. And X-Men. Little Archie, Uncanny X Men. <clears throat> Excuse me. I think that was it. I'm going to hold off on the arms because I want to do something different with them. I make her, yeah, I made her waist way too small for the rest of the body.
I'm the first to admit that my anatomy drawing isn't top notch. I I try I practice, but I still see myself as an amateur when it comes to drawing anatomy, at least by memory. I'm looking at an image, it's, I can pull it off. And feel free to ask questions, I'm paying attention to the screen. Or if you have any comments. Hmm. Okay, I'm still, I'm going to hold off on the other arm and the hand. What I'll do is bring in uh, for some reason Black Widow in the beginning had a fishnet bodysuit. I know Black Canary is well known for wearing fishnet stockings, but maybe the artist for Black Widow wanted to one up DC. Who knows? If you know of anybody who might be interested in watching this, please feel free to uh, invite them or however it works. I'm not sure really. Thank you. 
And the nice thing about the uh, the fishnet effect is that it also adds a little bit of uh, texture to the character. I'm going to cheat a little bit, and I'm going to use some reference material because I can't remember the color sequence for Black Widow's original costume. I know it's black for the most part. So, so as not to waste too much of my ink. Oh my goodness, I'm going to use India ink and brush. Hopefully. Oh, you know what? I do need to erase. Yeah, maybe it kind of looks like she's throwing something. Maybe it can make it look like she's throwing a grenade. I don't know. Just get rid of the other arm entirely so it's hidden from the from her body. Or, sorry, hidden by her. There. Okay. Being that this is a based on an Archie style, I don't have to worry about going into too great a detail. It's kind of a cop out, but since I'm doing this live, I don't want to spend too long with worrying about. Uh, where the light source is coming from and where the cast shadows are placed and whatnot. Looks like her cape is kind of blue or purple, so I can do the interior of it black. Now to separate the cape from her back, I just give a little bit of a white outline to her back so they don't blend together.
I might do a couple more of these videos for this uh, Stanuary tribute thing throughout the month. As it goes, every day is, of January is going to be a, uh, a different character. It's weird because I don't haven't seen any other artists on uh, Facebook or anywhere posting their sketches. In the coming days, I'll do. Uh, I'll try to change things up a bit to have some uh, more traditional kind of book style and some cartoony style. That's why I'm doing this. I feel like this one to be something more fun. Now, what for the smaller areas, I could use Sharpie marker, but when you use Sharpie marker and India ink, you can tell the difference pretty quickly. Of course, on screen, you can't. I might just cheat after all. I don't know if this is considered a uh, uh, beehive hairdo or a perm. I can't. It's hard to say, but that's roughly what Black Widow had at one point. Before, uh, she had long hair at different points. Oops. She had black gloves. And what I, a lot of times what I'll do is <clears throat> when I do an illustration, like a comic book character, a cartoon character, I'll pencil it and ink it and then I'll make a copy of it and then paint the copy. That way I still have the original. And I don't have to worry as much about uh, messing up. Still don't know what I'm going to do with the hand or hands.
I don't really want to do a fist because that's too too cheesy of a pose for a swinging a fist. It's an awkward stance for swinging on her because uh did a lot of you know, Black Widow did a lot of swinging in her day. Um, she tended to do a lot more uh, like Batman style swinging. But, and I can't compete with the first Black Widow that I did. Still Archie style, but with uh, the more familiar costume. There. Let's see. And then there's this one. Like I said, the more traditional look. And it looks like I could have done better with her hips. Sometimes it takes a different angle to before uh, seeing it at a different angle helps understand a little bit better. <clears throat> hmm. Let me sketch out a little bit, maybe. Ooh, that's a horrible finger. Yeah, I don't know what I'm doing with the hand. Does anybody have any suggestions? Anybody? Bueller? I think I want to have the hand cocked a little like that for a little bit more interest. Oh, I kind of like that, actually. Might change once I ink it. I can almost guarantee it will. But for now, I like it. I like it. Now, if you haven't, if you want to see the other drawings I did for this uh, Stanuary Lee uh, month long challenge. I've got the images on my Nettle Art group page. And for those just joining me, I'm doing the day three of the uh, Stanuary. Uh, drawing challenge and the third day was Black Widow and I decided to do Black Widow in the style of uh, Archie Comics. And Stanuary is in honor of uh, Stan Lee passing away in November and his birthday taking place at the end of December. Yeah, I have no idea what she's doing there. That's just looks weird. 
Oh, maybe. Maybe make it into a bow staff. Being that uh, like widow's a you know a super spy. Who knows, maybe she used a bow staff in there. I know that she used a, uh, some type of club. I can't think of the, the phrase for it. Or batons, there we go. Maybe it's batons I'm looking for. Which is interesting because uh, later on in the comics, the character Mockingbird used batons, and she was also Hawkeye's love interest and wife. Or maybe she's mopping. Yeah, yes, uh, she kind of looks a bit like she's mopping. Shuffleboard. She's playing shuffleboard. She's on a superhero cruise. How about that? Once I have all the erasing done, I'll post this on Facebook and Instagram, as well as the other Black Widow picture. Now, just because I did Archie comics for this doesn't mean I'm going to do like a Jughead version of uh, the Hulk. I don't think that would work well. See, I'm trying to create some line differentiation so it's not all one thickness. 
it helps add some weight and kind of provides a kind of provides some shadow. Unfortunately, I don't work very fast, so uh, you guys are probably bored stiff. Well, you're the ones that uh, showed up, so can I ask for it? Yeah, other than the fact that she looks like she's a uh, Sweeping. I'm kind of happy with this. Not early on in comics, I noticed that there, when they drew a female, a lot of times they would have to make black lips, including Archie comics. And I think, being that it's Black Widow, I think that. Do well, and it might have a little bit of a shine to the lip. And there we have it the third day challenge of the Stanuary Lee. 2019. I'll eventually fill this in, or I can just give her the gray costume that she had in the late 80s, early 90s. So uh, thank everybody for coming. I appreciate it. I hope you guys enjoyed it. And uh, next time I do one of these live event live. Uh, drawings i will post it on facebook as soon as i think of it so before i was able to uh, set up a time to do it and then invite people but then i couldn't get the video to work so i had to do a different connection i guess i don't know so this time it didn't give me the chance to invite people until after I started filming, which makes it awkward. So, all right. Thank you for coming. I hope you enjoyed it. And I will see you uh, probably in a few days.